what's going on everybody so um really didn't make videos today and the reason being is i work kind of worked my butt off today so i made uh i made two deliveries today and drove 528 miles so far it's 48 miles back to uh rochelle to the petro because i need a washout at the blue beacon and i'm gonna park at the petro tonight it was a good day though, I got no load in on payroll. So I ended up being a really, really profitable week for me as a solo driver. That's always a good thing. I needed a good week, I needed a good week. So, right now I'm at Walmart in Sterling, Illinois. I started my morning in Maple Heights, Ohio, just outside Cleveland. I made a delivery there. I picked up in Streetsboro, Ohio at the Stouffer's plant. And then I did a drop and hook here at this Walmart in Sterling tonight. It's uh, just after 11 p.m. And I'm going to go 40 miles back to Rochelle. And I'm going to pick up tomorrow in Belvedere. And I'm going to drop and hook in Auburn, Indiana tomorrow night. A lot going on really quick. But that's okay. That's how I make money. I don't mind it, you know. Uh, I got a good night's sleep last night. But I am starting to get a little tired now. But I'll, I'll make it back to Rochelle 40 miles I won't have a problem so all right guys I'll keep making clips we'll see where else this takes us what's going on all right so I'm at um I'm at Petro in Rochelle Illinois and I'm doing the laundry now today I had probably the best workout I've ever had in my life so like I did my normal workout, the 19 minutes I'm required to do the program. Then I started walking. Then like, literally like my body wanted to run. So I started jogging and then I sprinted, felt good. So then I come in here and got a shower and uh, now I'm doing my laundry. I was actually able to get a haircut too. So uh, it was a good day today. I pick up at 7 p.m. tonight, so. See how that goes. It delivers tonight anytime after midnight, drop and hook in Auburn, Indiana. So I go pick it up this evening and run it over there and drop it and uh, see what comes next. You know, it's kind of crazy, you know, when you only need a washout. This is what happens. I've been in line now for uh, over 50 minutes for a stinking washout at the Blue Beacon. FML. Welcome to trucking, bitches. You know, that time, you know, when they tell you to park and wait for them to call you and they decide to call you right when this shit starts. I'm sure you can see it blowing across the pavement. Or it's absolutely pouring out. And you know what you say? You say, screw it. Let me finish up editing a YouTube video first. And then hopefully the rain will be done before I go in. All right, what's going on? All right, so we're heading into July 4th, right? So you got to make sure you get your revenue in and get your get make sure you get freight that sets you up for better uh, a better week than most. At least that's the goal because it's a holiday, right? Holidays on Thursday. It means there's going to be a whole lot of stuff closed Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So I've got this little load tonight, 200 it goes 268 miles is what I have to do. Over to Auburn, Indiana, it drops. I pick up it tomorrow in Fort Wayne, Indiana, and I actually get to deliver on July 5th, just outside Washington, D.C. I'm betting that I'm gonna go pick up at the Budweiser factory in uh, Williamsburg, Virginia because they don't ever close. I actually picked up there on Christmas Eve once. Two Christmas Eves ago, yeah, I picked up there. So yeah, they don't ever close. But, so that's my guess. But we'll see. We'll see what he has planned. I don't know exactly, so. Oh, yeah. put, on the, put on the fake smile and hope for the best, right? All right, that's about it.
I'm going to take this load and deliver it. It's been busy, guys. I've done a lot. I did a lot today. Shit, I did a lot. I did a lot of work last night. I did a lot of exercise today. I'm sleepy. I cooked hamburger helper in my truck today. In my skillet. It worked, came out really good. So I went to Walmart today and I bought some uh, vitamins and stuff that I needed because I wasn't getting enough of certain vitamins still. So I bought some uh, men's one a days basically and then some like uh, some fiber pills and some other stuff. Just stuff I needed to get things right with my uh, daily intake. So I took care of that. I did a lot of shopping. I bought steak and chicken and ground beef and pork chops. It's all in the fridge for this week. I made hamburger helper today. I ate the whole damn box today between lunch and dinner. But even with eating the whole box, I still only consumed like 1,300 calories today. I bought some of these muscle milks. These are really good, guys. The flavor on this is pretty good. And then I also got a Walmart uh, off-brand of like Slim Fast meal replacement. The Equate, it's a strawberry. It's a strawberry and cream. It's actually not bad. It kind of tastes like cereal, cereal and milk. So this wasn't too bad either. So I was able to feel really full today and I only did 1,300 calories. That's pretty good. So we'll see how long that trend continues. But okay, I'm going to wait for them to call me with my paperwork. I'm already loaded. I tried taking a nap. I'm not sure if I got one or not. I might have. I don't know. I know I was laying there. The next thing I know they were knocking, but that doesn't mean doesn't mean I didn't sleep a little bit. I might have. You just have to wait and see how this goes. Four hours. And then pick up tomorrow. The next one's real good, guys. Pays over three dollars a mile or right at three dollars a mile. I'll take it. Take it with a smile at three bucks a mile. Okie dokie. I'm going to do a live tomorrow night because I should have time. It'll be July 3rd. So I'll do a live tomorrow evening. Tonight I'm out.